Well, hello there, motherfuckers. So I got my phone in hand here. As you guys know, I've been more active on Twitter. The bright light! Anyway, but thing is, I wanted to answer a question. Instead of answering the question on Twitter like a normal person, I'm going to fucking answer in a fucking video. So, um, Daryl Lee on my Twitter at Daryl Lee123 asks me, says, Hey, Brad, can I get your thoughts about hashtag Total Bellas? Well, Daryl, I'm going to tell you exactly what I think about Total Bellas. Who gives a flying fuck? I mean, seriously, you know, it's like WWE thinks everybody cares about this fucking shit. Now, I... I know it does well enough, uh, Total Divas, Total Bellas, whatever, Total Divas, Total Bellas ain't out yet. Does well enough to warrant all these seasons. So you're gonna, you know, keep shoving more of this shit down our throats so, you know, it's decent enough to stay on E. So, you know, why don't we make a spinoff, you know, why not? The show's a couple of years old. Let's just make a fucking spinoff. Why not? Let's let's make a fucking spinoff. So what they're doing is they're just centering it around the Bellas. Because, you know, everybody just loves the Bellas so much. I mean, what do they have to prove that the Bellas are the reason for that show's success? You know, the Bellas have done fucking nothing but annoy us. For like over six years in WWE, like seven years or some shit like that. What they debut in two thousand eight or some shit like that? Yeah, so they they've been here for so fucking long, annoying the fucking shit out of us, shoving them down our throats. We love Daniel Bryan, but Bree is just his wife, and you know that was Daniel Bryan's decision to marry her. But that doesn't mean we need to like her because she's associated with Brian. But, you know, anyway, the Bellas are our favorite. You know, it, it's your favorite, uh, you know, couple of divas because, you know, um, the WWE said so. So this is our favorites. You know, they're being, you know, this is what's being presented. Uh, so what did they do? They, they moved Cena and Daniel Bryan into the same house I'm reading. You know, with their wives so they could film it. And it's basically one guy that many people immensely dislike. Well, you know, John Cena seems pretty damn fucking popular compared to Roman Reigns. But, you know, one guy who was massively hated. And one guy that's massively loved living under the same roof. So I guess that's a little bit, you know, ironic, I guess you could say. But, um, you know, what do I think about this show is that I'm not going to watch it. I mean, you know, this there's no reason. There's more to life than Total Bellas. There's more to life than Total Divas. You know, I don't give two shits half the time about the, uh, the Divas division or, ooh, the women's division. So, you know, why should I care about a fucking show? Uh, about them in their lives. I don't give a fucking shit. I don't care if they take it up the fucking ass. I mean, really, I don't fucking care about fucking divas. Let's focus on making Raw better. Let's focus on making this product better. You know, and, and instead of attempting to give these girls personality on this show, and you know, in an effort to make all these boring chicks seem interesting... Why don't we actually make the wrestlers on fucking Raw the show that actually has more ratings that that is the most popular show. Most of the eyes of, you know, that watch anything WWE, the most eyes are on fucking Raw. Not SmackDown, not Main Event, nothing on the network. It's Raw. It's fucking Raw for a thousand fucking time. That's the only show that anyone gives a shit about. And most people... Don't even give a shit about that. So I say fuck Total Divas. Fuck the thousands of other fucking shows that they're making on the network. Stop all that shit and focus on Raw. Focus on those characters or lack thereof. Focus on those storylines 
all these interesting storylines for Total Divas. Ooh, where's the storylines on Raw? Huh? Where's the storylines on Raw? Got storylines for fucking Total Bellas, Total Divas. Where's the storylines for the most popular WWE show, you goddamn fucking idiots? So, Daryl, Lee, one, two, three. That's what I think about Total Bellas.